give generously? Yeah, right. Everyone's after my money and most people are looking for a handout. Who in their right mind would give to those who are less fortunate or even to the church? Now, the Babylon Bee is a fake news uh, Christian website and they offer a lot of comical uh, stories and articles. And, and I ran across one having to do with giving where they offer five reasons that Christians should give. Now, these are poor uh, reasons to give, bad reasons to give. But I, I have to be honest, there's probably some truth in these top five reasons that they offer. Firstly, they say this, you should give so their pastor will quit nagging you about it. <laughs> We've all found ourselves there before where the pastor just won't shut up about giving. Secondly, to get rid of all that annoying loose change. You know, we're entering that store with the guy outside asking for money, and the reason we get rid of it and give it to him is just simply we don't want it in our pockets uh, anymore. A third reason is for tax deductions. Obviously, that's why Christians give, right? To, to keep from paying the government so much uh, in taxes. Fourthly, this one's interesting, we should give so we can brag about it on social media. We've all seen those quote-unquote humble brags about how we've been giving to those uh, who are in need. Now, fifthly, a terrible reason to give, they say Christians should give so it forces God to bless you back. Now, friend, look, we all give at times and we have different motivations to give. This Sunday during our 11 o'clock worship hour, we're going to be looking at Scripture, 2 Corinthians chapter 8, and we're going to discover a good reason a Christian should give. For all of us, there should be an underlying motivation that propels us to give to those who are in need, to give to friends and family, and even to give to the church, even to support missionaries across the globe that we may never meet or interact with. And that reason we should give or be motivated to give is because of grace. You see, we've all experienced and been extended grace by God, and that same grace that we experience should motivate us to graciously and generously give to others. I hope to see you this Sunday, friend. My name is Pastor Ricky. Uh, if you're a visitor, pull me aside, shake my hand, uh, introduce yourself. I'll be happy to talk with you. Uh, man, we're going to look at God's Word. We're going to worship Him. And together, from Scripture, we're going to discover a good biblical reason, a motivation that we should generously give to others.